Hey guys, I don't know how to go live. I was trying to figure it out just a bit ago. But uh, I went to visitation today. I got back about an hour ago. And quite frankly, it was pro probably the worst visitation ever. Uh, they've got it set up to where we have to use the little phones in order to talk instead of being able to just be on either side of the glass. Well, his phone, oddly enough, had some issues. Every time he would try to put his information in, it would be cut off. Every time he would get maybe a sentence out, it would go to dial tone. Nothing more could be said. He'd hang up, have to do it all over again. In between all this, we were able to talk somewhat. Evidently, they have a video of him in Congressman Crawford's office. However, they have no audio to it. Another strange incident. <sighs> also, he has yet to see a public defender. On his medications, he's only being given two of them. When he's left alone, he's fine. When it comes to trying to contact anyone outside the jail, well, he has to borrow minutes and information from other inmates in order to get out. Every time he puts his information in, his call doesn't go through. Considering every other inmate is able to get their calls through except him, Sounds a bit fishy to me. On the jailmail.com, secure uh, jailmail.com, whatever the, whatever the heck that is, the online stuff, the online communications that the jail has, he has sent me a message giving me power of attorney. I cannot contact the public defender's office today. It is Saturday. I will be getting up early Monday and going either to the public defender's office or JPD, probably the public defender's office, and getting stuff going there. This is all bullshit. I ended up leaving the visitation more angry than when I was when he was arrested. <sighs> yeah. It, it, it's... Thank you, everyone, for everything you're doing to help. Um, Trent told me himself to call Chris Powers, and he's getting feelers out to everyone. I've had lots of people come on my phone, on my Facebook page, uh, Trent's YouTube, email, everything, and give me advice and whatnot. I've got a lot of advice, and sadly, I'm only one person. I don't have a lot of time, and when I don't have a vehicle, that restricts my time even more. He is asking for more boxers, socks, t-shirts, um pack of playing cards, 
Long John's paper, pen, all of this is available on, tom on tigercommissary.com. I'm going to be sending what I can, but I'm running low on funds for the month. So I'm probably not going to be able to send him everything he's requesting. If any of you have the availability of doing so, I ask that you do gift him these things. Um, basically, if he's not being treated right in there, it's going to make his mental state deteriorate even faster. I'm trying everything I can on my part to assist in that. And I'm trying not to get overly angry. Anyway. For the weekend, that's basically all I have that I can update everyone on. Anyone who has any other in information that they find... If they have any lawyer friends or anything of that sort that can call for information as soon as I can find out if he has a public defender assigned or not, I'm going to be pushing for a file of discovery to find out exactly what all has happened. <sighs> yeah. That, that's all I can think of to say. I'm sorry I'm not as good on YouTube as he is or any of you. Please bear with me as I figure all this out. Um, until next time, thank you.